It's a big barracuda. Something's bumping you. I don't know what it is. Good afternoon, guys. Welcome to my channel, Angler Elton. I'm joined here with my buddies. Angler Bob. Hi. Uh, Angler Ubrach. Today we are going to do the overnight camping and our main focus is uh, bait fishing. What's your target for today, Baba? Definitely Bara and Amur. Oh, what if we don't get any fish? Well, definitely, 100% uh, will get a fish. There's no like, saying there's no fish. There will be a fish. Target for today, Baba? King fish oh. and hummer. King fish and hummer? Yeah. What if we don't get fish today? No, sure, sure. 100% percent we get. 100%? Percent? Yeah. What do you get if you get catfish? <laughs> overnight, overnight we can get catfish also. Catfish? <laughs> yeah. What's the of catfish tomorrow? <laughs> fully packed, fully loaded. Fishing box, bait fishing gear, water, tent. Uh, we have all of our food. Let's hope we get some fish. So stay tuned, we keep you updated. Cheers. Okay, so we reached the tire deflation place. Just a quick stop, we'll deflate our tires to normally 16 psi, and then we'll be on our way. We just arrived at the spot, a little bit of wind, the water is still a bit high, we're just waiting for the water to go down and uh, we're just going to set up our camp in the meantime. So here's our tackle boxes, chairs, fresh water. A little tent, cooler box with ice, and there's our barbecue. And we're just putting up a windbreaker, so this should keep us uh, quite nice and uh, safe, as the wind might get a bit heavy later on. This is my place to sleep for the night. Only for sleeping. And this is the other tent. Big enough. Okay guys, we have Bal with two fish. He's managed to get this uh, agul, garfish, and now he's caught a uh, What's is a uh, flathead, guys? Struggle to survive, and it survives. <laughs> and survives. You can see the living. Yes, and it survives. Yeah. And it's gone. <laughs> Prepared my rod. So I'm gonna be going with my Daiwa BG and Okuma pelts. And I think I'm gonna use this all blue 40 gram. It's a white and orange. Uh, tiger this is also a very very good jig and they catch a lot of fish on this you can also use it at night and uh, they are glow jigs you can char charge them up with the uv light and they also work well at night
greenfish. This baby. <laughs> okay. Release. Bye bye. guys and we have Balu this third species he's got a very nice uh, beda I think the other name for this English name is purse mouth on shrimp nice boy yeah, let's keep him we can use him for live bait tonight we'll get some big and we have two in the bucket you can see we're gonna use them for live bait tonight. Okay guys, the sun is about to go down. As you can see, it's a beautiful sunset. I'm standing right on Sheraton Dune. This is the highest point around, guys. That's Saudi Arabia on the far side. And beautiful sunset. That is in the water, hoping for some fish. And uh, the sun's just about to go down. The tents are set up. Barbecue is ready. It's fishing time and once we come back, we prepare dinner. So as we said, we need to make a barbecue for um, Burger Fan. We're going to cut the shrimp into small pieces. So we can get some Burger Fan and make a barbecue. Are you preparing your bait? Yeah, this is shrimp. Very effective for Burger Fan, Beda. And sometimes Hamur also we catch. Hamur? Yeah, Hamur also comes. So, ah, okay, and there's the there's the rig. What yeah. are you using, guys? There's the normal one hand sinker. It's a small number six hook, two hooks on the rig, and that's it. So, hopefully, we'll get some good fun tonight. No more, but uh, we managed to land this vara, so it's good for a quick dinner. Uh, we can have, uh, as we promised, we're gonna have. Uh, dinner tonight at the fish barbecue catch and cook uh, this is one of the catch so we can eat it later we just completed the afternoon session and uh, there's the catches bye bye what do we have here uh, we have uh, three bedas beta, three beta, and two cooker fun uh, earlier we had caught one barracuda so barracuda in ice box and now we plan to make barbecue for this barbecue yeah yes. wow okay. fresh fresh just from this this water to your stomach bye bye what uh, are you cooking lovely day today we are cooking peda and gurgurfan gurgurfan yeah nice barbecue time so we have chicken on the barbecue and next we're gonna put the lamb chops Dinner is ready. Lamb chops, chicken, salad. Hi right, guys. So this is the result of bait fishing. We have two uh, suli fish. It's really a good size. Normally you get them very small. And this is what they are, maybe like 600 grams or so, maybe even more. And uh, good catch on shrimp. Another one in here, the second one. Nice catches, bye.
Yes. Very nice. I just got here and I had this rod in with a live bait, but something's bumping here. I don't know what it is. It's a catfish. A huge catfish, guys. This is the live bait that I had on earlier to catch the catfish. Just put a circle look. Even if they did, they still work okay. Circle look through his mouth. Maybe like around three kilos or so. Okay. Good morning, guys. We've just woken up, had some coffee, and uh, it's time to fish. It's fishing time now. Windy this morning. So uh, we're gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna go with a lure. Try for barracuda, maybe a hamur, a groper. The slow retrieve is very important. Just remember that guys. And the strike will come. I just had a strike and I think it's a barracuda. Do you have a plier? No. I didn't take my flyer. So, let's see what it is, guys. Looks like a barra. It's a good size barracuda, guys. It's a good size. Okay, guys. When I pulled the lure out of the barracuda's mouth, I didn't have a flyer. And the treble came off, so I have to change and I have to put a new lure now, guys. So, there's the lure, you see the treble has come off, and now I'm gonna put another one. Okay guys, second fish on with a new lure. It's a big barracuda guys. Look how it's splashing. You chomp that lure nicely. Splashing too much guys. There he is. Oh it's a huge one guys. Maybe four or five kilo. Maybe. Big, no? Good size barra. Good size catfish and a really big barra. It's a huge one, guys. Uh, how was the trip for you? Oh, very nice, man. Very, very nice. fantastic. Lovely trip, bye. We Lovely had. Trip. We enjoyed, by Basically, we caught some good fish, and we had barbecue. As we said, we did it. We caught the fish, and we did the uh, live uh, barbecue here, and catch and uh, eat was successful trip. Thank you very much, uh, bye. Hope to see you again next time. Yeah, definitely. Guys, very important. Once you're done. Please clear up your litter and leave the place in a good condition. It really helps to keep Kaja clean. And that's the end of our overnight fishing and camping. We're about to go home now. And uh, guys, thank you for watching. 
If you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up. 